Hello, my name's John and uh, welcome to this, the 18th A Coat of Armies painting tutorial for Warlord Games Epic Scale Napoleonics. Uh, today we'll be having a look at these guys, the uh, French Light Cavalry, the Hussars. This is the uh, first Hussar squadron. So fortunately they both start out the same, so here we go, good old Black Primer of your choice. Next up, of course, is uh, Games Workshop's White Scar Dry Brushing. Um, painting tip number 42. I go in first with a very, very light dusting. I mean, there's barely any paint on the brush, just so I can actually see where the details are. And then uh, I'll go back in a bit more heavy-handed in areas that need it. In a change from the usual programming, instead of uh, Kids Left Flesh, I've gone with Cadian Flesh Tone which seems to have come out quite nice. Um, the officer with the busby, I'll be doing him in gloves, so I haven't done his hands. So that's the uh, jacket, police and officer's shabrack done in Games Workshop's Calador Blue. So that's uh, Vallejo's brown leather for the reins and horse tack and what have you. And the officer the uh, scabbard, sword, little jingly bits on his sabre tash stirrups and the uh, edging of his saddlecloth there that's uh, all silver, lead belcher and also on the shako guys you've got the uh, musket barrel as well to do then I've gone with uh, Games Workshop's Evil Sun Scarlet for the officer's trousers Games Workshop White Scar, bit of prep work there on the uh, edge of the saddlecloth, sabre bits, uh, stripes on the police, coughs, sash, little pom pom on his hat. So now I've done the uh, Games Workshop Evil Sun Scarlet on his uh, sash, collar, uh, not his collar, his cuffs even, and uh, edging of the under edging of the saddle, which is quite sneaky. Uh, the bits on his hat, uh, the white sections on his uh, cummerbund, and on his blanket roll there. Games Workshop's Evil Sun Scarlet for the uh, edging of the saddle, cuffs, little uh, bobble on his hat, and on the uh, front on there if you're going to go to that level of crazy. Uh, the banding on his cummerbund and the Corellian red stripe down his trousers there. Uh, interesting factoid, to actually earn the Corellian blood stripe, each officer had to mount his horse and do the Kessel Run in under 12 parsecs. True story, look it up. Vallejo's brass for the uh, sword hilt and for the bits on his scabbard there. Games Workshop's Runefang steel on his uh, sabre and uh, the rim of his hat there. In close combat, they could actually take their hats off and use that and throw them at the enemy like a razor-edged weapon. True story. Saw it in a film. And last but not least, Vallejo's off-white for the uh, scabbard tassels. Bit of a redo on the uh, jacket there and the uh, sash. So for all intents and purposes, these lovely, fantastic gentlemen, you can consider them done. A little dab of Leo's London Grey on his uh, never out of fashion turn up set. So that's the commander or captain finished off with um, Ringfang Steel from Games Workshop on the blade and uh, Vallejo's brass on the uh, handle of his sabre. Then the other little bits it was needed. And I've done a really, really light Celestra Grey dry brush on his busby and on the horse's mane and tail just to bring those out a little bit but for all intents and purposes that's the captain done